to write dance. Okay, so we're going to be doing some exercise. So it's time to get into your pee kits if you're at home and ready to go. I'm certainly ready, so we'll start with our volcano dance. Okay, you ready? Let's play the music. Rumbling and marching and marching again. knees straight backs wide at the bottom bend, bend as low as you can good job everybody hey for the music go side to side Volcano up and down and those knees down, up and down, up and down. Good job, everybody. Ready for that lava? Good job. What comes after? Can you remember? Well done if you remember the rain. On your tiptoes, hold it for as long as you can. Straight arms. Your arms next to your ears. You hear the rain. Good job, everybody. Flick those wrists one at a time. And if you heard the change of music and walking around. Well done everybody, give yourself a clap. Okay, we're going to move on to our next one. We are today going to do the robot one next. We're going to do the slightly different song. Okay, so you can join in with me. Now, let's just make sure I've got the right music. Here it comes. Work those fingers. And the arms. One arm. Other arm. And your legs. Keep your back straight. Keep your toes. a bit crazy, so arms up. And step and clap. Step, clap, step, clap, step, clap, step. And a slow turn. And again. Lovely. And again. Crazy robot. and your marching finish. Well done everybody. Good job. Didn't face you at all doing a different song. Okay, right, so that's our robot one. We're going to move on to our horse one. Remember with your reins. Forwards and backwards. You can go wherever you like in your homes as you practice your horse dance. And then slowly start to walk. When it gets faster, you get faster. Try and gallop one foot. 
forward, bring the other one to it. A little bit faster, you might want to swap legs. Try and go different directions. Right, are we ready? Try and go a bit faster. And do different directions. Maybe just backwards and forwards and backwards. Good. Keep going as much as you can. You can go anywhere in your homes, just practicing your galloping. And stop. Well done, everybody. Super job. Okay. Right, we'll have a go at our hairs. This is the one that Mrs. Bottom finds a little bit tricky as she's got a baby growing inside her tummy. So you can show me how well you can do your hops because I'm sure you can do them a lot better than me. But we'll have a go together. All right, so can you remember the hairs one? So it's when you're crouched up, you're a little shy hair and you're looking for somewhere, somewhere to go and something to eat, okay? So you'll start off by being small and just looking up to see what you can spot and then off you go. You brave your hops to go and find that lovely cabbage or whatever it is that you're looking for. Here we go. around. Three. And off you go. Hops. Oh, just check. Sneak somewhere. Where have you found that cabbage? And off you go again. Practice those hopping. Take your arms over if you can. Bend those knees. Find something else, something to eat. And off you go again, a bit quicker, trying to hop. And then hiding away. And then even quicker, I can't go any quicker, but you can. Oh, and then hiding away, till it's safe to come out again. And again, so you can do those hops. Keep going, eating that cabbage. And again, same again, perhaps you could do it hops in different ways. And then eating that cabbage, reaching for it, checking nobody's looking for you or spotted you. Good, one more go, jumping off you go. Even faster, keep going. Find somewhere to hide. Well done, everybody. That's our hair one, isn't it? Really good job. Okay, so we've got a new dance to learn today. Are you ready? So our new one today is all about the sea. Hands up if you like the sea. I do. Do you love going to the beach and splashing in the waves? It's good fun, isn't it? And I know when we had a wow day, lots of you love learning about under the sea. So our next dance is going to be all about the sea. So the first thing that you need to do is to lie down. And we're going to listen to some music. And it's going to make us think of calm waves. Okay? So you're going to just close your eyes. Imagine you're at the seaside and it's lovely and calm. The waves are really calm and you're just going to listen to the music, okay? There we go, it's coming up now. Right, so lie down. Just listen to the music. Make sure you're breathing nice and slowly, taking deep breaths. Close those eyes, arms by your side. Hear the seagulls going. Lovely to hear them at the seaside, isn't it? You can move your arms 
slowly come up. Okay, we're going to have the same music again. This time we're going to start lying down with our eyes closed. Okay, and then you can slowly move your arms like the waves. And when it feels like the wind is getting a little bit, little bit faster, okay, a bit more blowier, then you can make yourself slowly stand up and then we are going to let the wind take us. It's as if the wind is taking the waves and we're moving our arms up and down. All right, so that's what we're gonna do. So let's try from the beginning again and then you can follow me to when you can hear that wave, hear that wind, sorry, going for us to stand up. Take the music back. Right, here we go. I'm lying down. Move your arms, you can. Right, look at you here. Feels like that wind's picked up, slowly getting up. Pretend the wind is taking you. So, slowly move your arms. That's it. Those lovely waves being carried by the wind. Any direction. And then as the wind dies down, so do you go slower and you come to your knees. So the wind stops. Well done everybody, super! Right, so that's the first part of the sea dance. The second bit is all about making little waves with your arms. So you're going to think about the little ripples of the waves. So you're going to take your arm out and you're going to do just little ripples with one arm. And then the same with the other one. Little ripples, little waves. Okay, and then we're going to do both together. Okay, can we have a little practice? And both together. Okay, starting from the middle of your body and then going out. Should we try with the music? Let's have a go. Here we go. Another one. This one again. Another one. And both. as you do it. Tricky to do that. Good. Right, we're going to stop it there. Lovely. Well done for doing those little ripples. It's quite tricky to do it in time with the music. Okay, we can always go backwards as well. Back into the middle of your body. Super job, everybody. Okay, so that completes the dance part. So now you need to go and get yourselves a drink, okay? And then come along and watch the second video where we do the de where we do the writing part of our video. Well done, everybody.